What are you doing in my room, Doge? It's really messy, man. Look, I brought the Doge some tweets. Yeah, I hear you want some treats? Come here. Come here, Doge. Come get your tweets. Oh, that's just... That's so good. Oh, that's... That's asthma. <gasps> Doge, we're doing asthma, finally! They're not the loud, crunchy treats, but he, he really likes these, so... <laughs> that's just what we have to do now. That's just such a really, 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 really good Doge! What's up, boys? Today we are opening the new Pokemon Paldea Adventure Chest. It literally just came out and it's got six booster packs, a squishy toy, and a sticker sheet. Well, that's convenient. Wait, look at the Doge over there. Doge, what are you doing? Doge's just gonna go to bed. Oh, <gasps> Doge, it's just, that's just the cutest thing ever. Focus camera on the Doge, thank you. Hey, he's just so cute in Dale. That's just a good Doge. Well, here's our big sticker board. We're slowly making progress. We've been adding stickers every uh, Pokemon video. So what I wanna do is get the stickers out of this chest thing and we'll add it to the sticker sheet. So I got my scissor knife. We all love the scissor knife. Yeah, come on. I don't know if you saw that, but the scissor knife is awesome. And we're focusing on the window for some reason, not on the Paldea Adventure Chest cringe camera. Why is this so hard to rip off? Hello? Okay, there we go. Time to open the Paldea Adventure Chest. Oh. Okay, sorry. I don't know what that was. But anyway, we have Pikachu in the front here. Where do we even start? This thing's big. Um, we got a card here that's kind of hiding. Can we just like... Wait, maybe I just pull this off here? Okay, let's take this off. What Pokemon is this? I think it's a Palmy. I can't see. No, Palmot. Okay, so we got a Palmot here. His hands look like big balls. He's about to eat them, put them in his mouth. It's kind of weird. Put him to the side there. Oh, look, we got another one. Oh, we got three. Well, we need to take both of them out. So the next one we have is Moshold, or I think it's Mousehold. Imagine these creepy things in your nightmares just recharging you, chasing you down the hallway, and you can't find the end. Nom, 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 nom. That'd be kind of weird. All right, now the last one we have is uh, Sprigatito. Sprigatatio? Sprigatishi? What's with the auto-focusing? It's really bad today. So we got um, a Scratch Attack. Attack, magical Leaf. Does 100 damage and then also heals him for 30. That's a pretty good attack. Oh, there's a code card inside. Well, I'm not going to open that. Please stay focused. Dude, stop. In the back here, we have... What is this? I think this is a little card holder. Oh, speaking of card holders... Okay, that was probably a bad idea. This is no longer a 151 binder. This is literally all my top cards. I decided to put every top card I have in this binder. This is just the craziest binder ever. Look, I got the Lugia. I got the Urshifu and all these. Just the best cards you can imagine, right? The Charizard that we pulled from Paldean Fates. We got this one up here. Yeah, I pretty much have every good card from the last... 10 years, like we got like the Giratina. I'm pretty much a collector if you want to say, okay, well, let's just get, look at all this. This is called heat, boys. We got the heat up in here. Okay, anyway, so that's this binder. This is all my top chasers. This binder here, this is where I'm putting all my full arts. Every card that's just full art and awesome goes in here, even if it's worth like 50 cents. I don't care. I love the full arts. I think they're amazing. And I'm sorry if the lighting's bad. Hold on. I think you can kind of see better like this. I don't know. We'll go through these another time. What we want to do is get more stickers on this thing. So where, where's the sticker sheet? It's supposed to be a sticker sheet. Okay, what is this? I think this is uh, just like a deck holder, I'm guessing. I don't know. Put that over there. We got... Oh, I almost hit the camera there. Oh, there's the sticker sheet. Okay, so we have this little plushy, little Pikachu plush. We'll take him out. What we want is a sticker sheet down there. Give this to me. There we go. We got it. We got the sticker. We got the, uh, I forgot his name already. We got Pikachu, the mouse hole, the creepy little mice that are attacking you in your dreams. Pokeball, and then the, these happy fellers. Well, we have five stickers to add. That's kind of a lot, actually. So let's take these cringe bakas first. We're just going to put it right there. Why not? Looks like a good little spot to me. Then we got this guy. I forgot his name. Put her, uh, uh, no, that's too close to that one. Let's put it up here next to the uh, creepy child chaser known as Mr. Mime. Then we got the creepy mice. I think we put these ones next to the uh, prime ape up there. Then we got this cute little guy. Yeah, he's just a cutie, isn't he? I will put him down near the bottom. Or her, sorry. Last but not least, we got the Pikachu! I want to put the Pikachu right in the middle, just like this. There we go. Our sticker board is looking better and better every day. Now there's supposed to be some booster packs in here. Oh, there we go. I opened it up and we got six of them. So let's pull these out. And what do we have here? We have Paradox Rift, Obsidian Flames, Paldea, Paradox again. And okay, all from Scarlet and Violet. No old packs, no Sword and Shield. No Sun and Moon, that's okay. I do like the new Scarlet and Violet sets, to be honest. I think they're pretty good. Paldea Evolve's a really good set. But then we also have this Pikachu. 
can't forget about this idiot. Maybe we'll give him to the Doge. You know, this, the Doge would just absolutely tear this up and destroy. You know what? Let's see what happens, actually. Hey, Doge, I got a new toy for you. Okay, that was the worst throw ever. Let's get the Pika. Doge, look. What is it? Doge, get it. Doge, get the Pika. Don't you just want to get the Pika, Doge? Okay, he doesn't care. Oh, Doge, I know. It's another dark and gloomy day. So the house is just, yeah, it's cold. It's dark. Doge is just sweepy. So we'll just let him sweep and Dale. Good boy. I'm just gonna put the Pika here. If you saw the last video, I opened the Fates Collide pack to start things off. Ready? Bam! Oh! 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 This time, I'm gonna open two Steam Siege XY. Okay, focus, thank you. The reason we're doing Steam Siege and not Fates Collide is because I pretty much have all of the Fates Collide cards, so. Crack on into these. See if we can pull some heat, baby. I believe we put three in the front for these. Why, yes, we do, okay. We have a Drivlim, dumb hot air balloon. We got a cube or a dice, whatever. We got Ozermill, Ponyta, Dino, looking like he needs a haircut. Can't see anything, he's actually blind in the forest, running into trees. We got a stupid candle. We got the, the guy who needs a nose job. We got a, a cute little chimp char. Looks like he ate. Oh yeah, he destroyed like a machine in the back. Camera, stop it. Then we got, oh cool, we got the, a clay guy. I love collecting these like clay realistic Pokemon, so we save that. And last but not least, we got a hollow chandelier. What is going on here? This person's like running, is that like a fire? But this guy just doesn't care because he probably started the fire. Stupid camera focusing on the background because it's a piece of trash camera made by trashy developers. All right, next Steam Siege pack. Rip that open, we put, oh we got black code card, which means this pack is gonna Suck. So I try to hide the code card so I don't get spoiled. Are we focusing on the background again, camera? What if I go up here, put the cards like right here? Use your brain, you stupid camera doesn't have a brain because it's trash. We got a Nuzleaf, he's hiding up there in the tree, just creeping on people that walk by. We got a stupid fossil, we got Seedalt. I just want to rip off his helmet. We got the guy who needs a nose job again. We got a little Lilial Hider, Hop It. Okay, and okay. We're focusing on the window. Toxic Croak to finish it off. Just a little uh, rare here. Nothing special in those packs. I've also brought 12 packs. We got six Chilling Rain and six Vivid Voltage. We're gonna do these after we do the packs from the chest. Let's just start with the Obsidian Flames. Why not? Pull the Gold Fire Energy from the set and then I lost it. I just have no idea where it is. Did we do one? Oh no, I don't think we do any. Oh, wait, it's just one in the front. Okay, we throw the energy because it's trash. We got Magnemite. It looks like he's, um, yeah, family-friendly channel. Oh, Larvesta Clay. Okay, well, I wanna save him. Put him to the side. We got the Rowlet. We got Bunnelby, drunk under a tree, a little moon thing. Dartrix, an owl that's angry. We've got a fat pig. Love me some pork. We got Houndstone into a reverse or just a regular hollow thunderous. All right, now we have a Scarlet and Violet base set. If you just like opening packs, you can get uh, the base set booster boxes for like 80 bucks if you look in the correct place. It's really, really cheap right now. So highly encourage you buying some if you just like to open packs. All right, we got another fat pig. We got Lechonk. We got Chansey. And then Miradon Hollow. Give us something epic, please. I want to scream. Next pack, we got Paradox Rift, the latest set. Ooh, black code card. I think this is a good sign. I wish they would just make all the code cards the same color so you didn't know if you're uh, gonna get a good card. All right, we got a scared fish. The monkey stealing apples out of uh, the farmer's tree. That's really bad. You can get shot for that. Got stupid medical. Oh my gosh, okay. The waifu in me activated for a second because I thought this was her booty. I was like, damn girl, look at that, she thick. We got Tinka Tuff into a cloth and a holographic Kingdra. Nothing to be excited about. Still a really cool card. I would love to see this in like a full art version. Well, so far we have three holographics. So it's like we're getting good packs, but not the hits that we want. All right, Paldea Evolve. Card I need from here. Ooh, another black code card. That's a good sign. The card we need is Magikarp. I've never gotten the Magikarp from Paldea Evolved. It's really hard to get, but maybe we'll get lucky here. I think we have something on the end, actually. I'm really excited, boy. I get to scream into the mic. We got a stupid uh, Tumbleweed. Kufant, he's got like a spoon for a nose? What? Okay, Crow Gunk. More like Crow Drunk, am I right? Look, he's drunk. Okay, we got Waifu, but not good Waifu enough. Okay, Guys, actually we have a good card on the end here. I'm really excited. So we have a rare Weevil. And under this, look. Look boys, got something shiny. 270 out of 193. Oh, what's it going to be, boys? It is. Oh, I got some 
Maya can see Saguaro! Full art Saguaro trainer. He's washing the dishes with Jigglypuff and this little squirrel on his shoulder. This cute owl looks like he has glasses, but he doesn't. This is honestly one of my favorite trainer cards from this set. I've never pulled it. Heck yeah, baby. I just love Jigglypuff's eyeball. I just love Jigglypuff in general. Just such a really cute Pokemon deal. Oh, and then we have a Palma on the end. That's pretty cool. That's kind of like a double hit in a way. Almost. But this, that is an amazing pull. Look at his hair. This guy's just actually so Alpha Giga Chad. I love it. So far, every single pack in this chest has had at least a hollow. So that's a really good sign. And we still have two more packs. Let's put him in here. Lean him against the Pikachu back here. Wait, actually it's center. Okay, Pikachu is not strong enough. And that's just gonna fall over. Cool. Next pack, Obsidian Flames. What if we pulled the Charizard? Oh, look, again, black code card. Every single pack in this chest is like, Insane, actually. Not insane, but you know what I'm saying. All right, here we go. Cry Cryogonal. Every pack is like giving us a chance, is what I'm saying. We got, it looks like a broccoli just running through the forest. Very confused. We got Dolive. This is like a waifu in the Pokemon world. All the men Pokemon look at her and, and sign up for her OnlyFans. We got Armor Rouge. We got Among Us. We got uh, this Toad. Seismitoad. He looks depressed. He's just got his one flower here. He's really happy, protecting. That's actually a good life. We got Crabrawler. We got Toxel being toxic. And, whoops, uh, Palafin. Pretty much the Giga Chat of all Pokemon. He's really buff. He evolves from a whale. They overprinted him in Paldean Fates. All right, our last pack, Paradox Rift. I'm actually really impressed with this set. We're five for five. Another black code card. So... What this means is you just have an opportunity for something good. If you get the white one, you're not getting anything. You're not even getting a holographic. You can get like a trainer gallery or whatever they're called, but black code card means you can get like an ultra rare. Okay, we did not actually just go fast here. Instead, we just got a hollow. Dang it. Unlucky folks, but you know what? That was still pretty good. I'm impressed with the chest. So six packs, six hollows, plus this guy. So that's not bad at all. We take those. Now it's time for the Chilling Rain and Vivid Voltage. I'm actually really excited for this. Chilling Rain is becoming really expensive. So we're gonna alternate between the packs. Vivid Voltage is not expensive because there's only one good card in the whole set. Don't get me wrong, it's a beautiful set. It's just that people only want the Pikachu. Okay, we got the white code. That's actually a good sign. So four to the front. Okay, so we start with the energy. We got Nessa Waifu, we got Suelo. We got a zebra. We have lice. We got angry ball. Cute little rock rough. He's got fleas though, so he's itching. We got Wismer crying in his. Oh, it's a whisper Pokemon. It should say whimpering Pokemon. He continuously tumbles out of your life into a holographic Lugia. So again, we keep getting the hollows, but not like the full ultra rare ones. But white card equals holographic or better. This has become a hollow video. All right, Chilling Rain, show us what you got. I'll try not to spoil. I don't want to see the code card. Okay, see, so I'm not gonna look at the other side. Go to the front, throw the energy. We got Spiral Energy. We got Honey, which is a waifu. We got Avery. I don't know if that's a guy or a girl. We got Skavit running in the field. Fat little whale thing. We got a donut. Yeah, oh, clay. A cast form. So we're gonna take this. It's not really clay. This is more like plasticky. So we're gonna save that. Ooh, now that is... Oh, look, it evolves from the, the earlier waifu we saw. So she is growing up. We like that. Ooh, look, holographic Taurus. So that means that this is a white code. Yep, it's white. But again, just stupid hollow not nothing better give me something better my goodness okay another vivid voltage hey doge we need a uh, better luck please doge doge i see you in there you're staring at me can you uh, give me better luck please I'll do that really quick all right yeah we, we got the energy good we got zeb streaka again we got the stupid bird uh waifu clefairy we got fan fee fan fan p fan p is a little elephant about to eat the the bear that's a cute bear why would you eat that long nose pokemon okay we got stupid bug this is like the artist just didn't know what to do so you just made a bug that has characteristics from like five different bugs and we got meowth looks way different than meowth anyway what do we have on the end nothing because this is a black card yeah see or green rather so white equals good Green equals bad or scam. All right, next pack, Chilling Rain. Here we go. Start with the Electro. Oh, we got something good on the end, folks. <laughs> I saw a little <laughs> poking out there. Let's hope it's an ultra, ultra secret mega rare, please. We got the Venipede. I don't know. He looks sad, actually. 
What's this, a snover? He's saying, stop, you're not allowed to pass. You do what I say, Slowpoke dipping his poisonous tail into the water supply, single-handedly murdering the entire village. We have Crebrawler. Those look like giant like blue boxing gloves and, and little green peas. Into the poor, wait, I skipped one. They, they got sticky. Okay, snow run, don't care. Porygon 2, all right. What do we have on the end? Impress us, make me scream. Into! <gasps> Celebi. Well, that's not exciting. It's pretty, but it's just a basic V. He is just really cute though. Look, he's doing his little leaflet dance. All right, next vivid voltage. Anything that doesn't go in the binder gets donated. All right, you know what? We have a really good card in here. I think I saw some silver. Folks, that could be massive. What if it's the, the Pikachu? All right, we have Nessa. We have the bird again, a Zebastrika. We're getting the same cards. Execute, just want to cook him, make an omelet. <laughs> Woo bat. He's just enjoying his day on the dock. Look at that. His eyes are closed. His one buck tooth. Beldum. I don't even know what that is. It's an iron ball Pokemon. Yeah, pointless. Blitzel. We got Mil Milsery Cream Pokemon. Okay. All right, folks. Behind this reverse hollow lies a good card. Let's look at the number. <gasps> Oh my goodness, 188 out of one, there's no way. It's not the Pikachu, but it's gonna be something good. Ready? Oh! Oh! Holy crap, guys, we did it. Holy crap. I did not think it was the Pikachu. I've never pulled this card. I have never pulled, I own it. I bought a PSA 9 of this, but I've never pulled it. Holy crap. How's the centering? Uh, it's, it's pretty good. It's actually really good. I don't think it's perfect because this side's a little bit skinnier than this side, but it's pretty good. Oh my God. How did we pull a Pikachu VMAX Secret Ultra Mega Rare? We just pulled the top card in the whole entire set. How did we just do that? I, I honestly am stunned. Never in a million years did I think we would pull the Pikachu from six random vivid voltage packs that I had just laying in my closet. So it's been sitting in my closet for years this pikachu's been hiding out there just whispering to me waiting for me to come rescue him or is it a her i don't think we'll ever know this card's worth about 120 dollars raw but this is the main card that everyone tries to get from vivid voltage so well guys that's the video i'll see you next time no, i'm just kidding we're gonna still open the rest jeez that's just crazy you no know, we're just gonna put him right here in the background so you guys can stare at it all right chilling rain now just give us the blaziken and then this will be the best opening ever. Blaziken is the top pull in Chilling Rain. It's about, well, it's actually getting really expensive. Every time I look at the price, it's gone up. Last time I checked, it was $170. All right, here we go. We got, this looks like a shield. That's what I thought it was at first, but he's definitely evolving. He's gonna become a, a bee drill soon, I think. All right, stupid sheep looking lost. Heracross all, ooh! I love this! The little clobberbush is gonna fight you on the beach. And it's the clay type, so we save it, or the realistic ones. We got a Grookey chopping the, the stump. I don't know. We got Frost Last into a non hollow surfetch. So that means black or green background. Yep. How did we just pull that Pikachu? That's just actually insane. I'm shocked. What if we pulled two? Wait, this code card's like extra thick, kind of weird. All right, four to the front. Look at me talking about pulling two. That's just crazy. All right, look at this little wolfy guy. I actually really like him. He's really pretty up there. We got, I thought that was his booty. Maybe it is his booty and he's just stuffing his, he's like eating over here. He's gonna take a crap soon. Have you ever seen a fish take a crap in the ocean? Ooh, that's a cute little clay Pokemon. That one too, little Drillbur idiot hiding in the mud. Or maybe that's his own crap. He like drill, ooh, tail out, reverse hollow. Well, that's cool. And we got nothing on the end. Come on, Chilling Rain. Let's hit something big. It's really hard to get anything in Chilling Rain. But maybe we'll get really lucky. Here we go. Lucky Energy. That's right. Give us the luck. We do have something on the end, actually. I can see the little border here. Let's just get to it. I'm really excited. Oh, yeah. Score Bunny. Push that up the hill. That's like that Sisyphus guy, right? That, like, Greek god that's just stuck pushing a boulder forever. All right, Deerling, you're looking lost. A lot of the Pokemon just <laughs> look like, what is this guy doing? He's just looking so sad, Dale. Maybe he's trapped, he can't escape. All right, what we got behind here? 97 out of 198, so it's not a secret, it's not the top hitter, but it's gonna be really nice, ready? Oh, 
Galarian Moltres. That's actually a nice card. A really beautiful Moltres here. The top Moltres in this set is like $110. Very hard to pull. I've never pulled it. I do own it though. Let me show you. It's in the hitter's binder. This is the Moltres from Chilling Rain that you want to get. It's one of the top cards. Really hard to pull though. I've never done it. Someday I will get it. Probably not though because Chilling Rain is going to start getting really expensive really quick. If you have a bunch of Chilling Rain lying around, I would suggest just saving the packs and then buying the singles because those packs are going to start getting really expensive. You watch in like three or four years, it's going to be like $15, $20 a pack or more. Oh, black card. That means this pack sucks. Let's just go really quick. Ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, trash. Where's our rare card? Where's it? Right here. See? Non-hollow. Trash explode. All right, Chilling Rain. Show us some magic here. Got nothing out of the Chilling Rain so far because it's one of the hardest sets to pull anything from. We got the Chopper again. I don't know why he's doing that. Lost Sheep. Happy Puppy. I love that Pokemon. One of my favorite. We got two of these and then nothing on the end. We got a monkey! All right, last Vivid Voltage. Green card means trash. I keep accidentally looking at the code card. I don't mean to do that. But we can just go fast because we know when, well, we're not getting anything. Ooh, that bath looks really amazing, actually. I just want to lay in it. Look at all that steam. There's probably a lot of Epsom salt. Really good for your skin. We got Hitmon Top. Training with a waifu in the background. I wish I could train with her. Ain't that right, boys? I want to be training with the waifus. All right, what do we got? We got nothing on the end. Bennett. It's actually a really nice Pokemon. He's got a spooky shot. It's going to shoot it all over you. All right, last pack, guys. Last pack magic. Chilling rain. Oh, we got something in here. Oh my god. I don't know if you guys saw that. Oh, it's peeking out. I'm trying to hide it. I'm sorry. Let's not spoil the fun. Okay, this is going to be a good way to end the video. We're going to end with hopefully a secret rare. Look at that chest plate. Put on the armor of God. Ephesians chapter 5, 6. I can't remember. But it's in there. That, this is actually a nice waifu right here. Caitlyn. Really pretty. And then we got snow guy we got he's stuck actually there's a lot of polar bears uh, around so the minute he falls into the ocean he's dead so don't be tricked actually it's electrified so maybe he'll just shock the water and kill everything all right we got ghastly cool um yeah this guy's stealing your presence it's actually illegal so if you have a shotgun you can just blast him we have lydian flying all right what do we have on the end here guys Let's take a little peek at the number. Eight out of 198. So nothing super valuable, but maybe it's really pretty. And Celebi V Max. Okay, so we got the uh, regular Celebi V first, number seven. And then we just pulled number eight. It's V Max version. So this was just a Celebi opening, I guess. Not valuable at all, but it's really pretty. Look at the artwork. I just love these full arts. It's just, oh my gosh. Just hits me in the heart, okay? It's not going to go in the binder because that's for my cards that are worth $10 or more, but it's still really pretty. And so we keep it forever and ever and ever. Let's head to the end here. We got a nice little spot just for the Pikachu. Look at this Hitmonchan I have. Isn't that awesome? If you know, you know. It's from 2003. Okay, so we're going to add the Pikachu. Let's pull him out of here. And then we're just going to slip him in. Bam. Just like that. Like I said, I already have another Pikachu. You know what? I'll go show you. So here's my closet, a little peek into my collection here. The lighting's really bad, but here's all my waifus. They're just all stacked up here. I got a binder coming for them. And there it is, the Pikachu. Here it is in a PSA 9. My slabby slab, I just keep here in my closet. I got a bunch of old packs here, all the Cosmic Eclipse, some Ultra Prism, Unbroken Bonds, you know, stuff that's, uh, here's my Steam Siege that I opened today, just grabbed two from there. Here's all my Fates Collide on my desk, and then I actually keep my Charizard slabs on my desk as well. So I got like the, the Brilliant Stars one. Got the 151, yeah, you know, I got all these really cool little Charizards. If you know, you know, folks. So, yeah, there you go. Just a little peek into my collection. Not opening the Fates Collide anymore because we pulled the Alakazam. Those are about $15 to $20 a pack, by the way. This is a PSA 10, by the way. It means it's perfect. Zero imperfections. All right, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I'll catch you next time. Uh -huh.